Welcome to the very first Excalibur container cabin that was put on the premises of the Dell Warehouse. Gabe lived in here first and now Willie lives in here. Yeah, I'm going to let him give you the tour. He um, said he wants to start in the bathroom. What's going on folks? This is my my container. This is my bathroom right here. It's got a toilet. Pretty fancy shower. It's kind of like a space capsule kind of thing. Pretty cool. Mirror and I got I made this little closet deal because it's a really big bathroom. Yeah, all my panhandle shirts are here. A lot of people were asking me about this with that dance I was doing. It's panhandle. It's my dirty clothes. You need to do some laundry. Yeah, I know. Sorry. Sorry, Mom. I'm working on it. The kitchen got this pretty fancy fridge with some rodeo time decals, you know, a little decoration. Got my sink. Plenty of cabinets, you know, I don't really use them that much. Got some oatmeal and some cocoa bubbles, some Oreos. Got my stove, microwave, my collection of retired hats. Just because they're sentimental, each one has a different memory, so I can't just let them go. You know what I'm saying? Right. And then, you know, I got my bookshelf. There's two, there's two Goat Dales, and you know, I gotta represent the other one, Dale Earnhardt, so I got his car. Actually, Junior drove this one, but this is my little bookshelf, keep my shoes here. Got my ammo for my Shadow Whisper in case anyone wants to mess with the warehouse security. Is that a pellet gun? Yeah, and then this one's for the people that really want to misbehave. This will this will stop you in your tracks. So yeah, come mess with Winnebago. Got some artwork from my cousin or my nephew. Got an antique feed bag it's from 1873. It, you cannot buy these at the local grocery store. 100% you can. Got yep. a candle to set the mood. This is where I kick back and relax like my friends here are doing. Got my TV mounted. That took me a really long time to figure out. Yeah, did you guys tell if you could poke holes in the walls? Hey, can I put holes in the walls? Is that cool? Uh, yeah, we'll talk about that after the video. Got some DVDs that Leroy donated to me and a DVD player. Loaned. Loaned. With an ED, just like barbed wire, ED. Then I got this from when um, Dale went to William Clark Green and he was nice enough to let me come with him. So, we were actually cleaning up the booth and this was in the dumpster and I was like, heck no dude, that's cool. I've got the Texas flag the right way now. Because I like Texas, I want to make sure everything's right. You gotta be patriotic, you know. And then this is my, this is my bedroom, not a lot goes on here, I just sleep. That's pretty much it. Got my swim trunks when it's about to get tropical. Got an American flag with my American hats. My rock and rolls are right here. That's where I keep all my stuff and then some cool stickers. They actually have all of Dale's sponsors. They don't actually don't sponsor me, but it's cool decals. Penn State jersey. Total feeds. What can I say? This place is pimped out. Thanks for all the plugs in there. Uh, we're going to go to <laughs> container cabin number two. Excalibur container cabin number two. This is a 45 foot Blythe Eep, aka Beep Beep, stays in it. She is our newest intern. I'm gonna let her uh, take over on the tour. Yeah, so this is uh, this is where I live. Uh, my neighbors pretty loud, pretty rude sometimes. Um, I hear Kevin every morning at 6:15 as he walks down. Where's oh, Kevin? Kevin, you gonna come in and join the tour? Yeah. Um, so, um, this is where I get most of my work done. This is where I nap. This is uh, the pile corner because I have nothing to store all of my black boots and everything in. It's a lawn chair. It's a speaker. As I, so I have to drown out Kevin's noise because he talks all the time. Just <laughs> this is my bathroom. Pocket doors. Oh, yeah. I almost scared you today, but somebody else walked in. Yep, the shower. Um, this bathroom. I fit this rack in, but the toilet paper holder couldn't work, so I had to take that off. But yeah, it's a nice rack. <laughs> <laughs> bunk this beds. Is, oh, you got bunk beds? I know. Chris this is where that. my roommate lives. Uh, you don't know about her. She's she's new. She's okay. Yeah, her yep. name is. Um, as long as you're charging the rent and getting, getting paid. <laughs> yes, it's, uh, I'm, I'm learning it? here. Yeah. This is a sleeping bag, makeshift um, comforter. 
because you can use both. And I know most of you might not be able to see it, but it's there. Yeah. So this is my closet. Thanks. Yep. That's a nice size closet. I know. I'll close it. Mirror. That extra five feet really does. Hi. Well. Yep. That's a TV. I didn't have to mount this one like Lily did, but the holes came already in the container. Have you used it yet? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I do. I do a lot. Blythe is also um, taking college courses online. So she uh, stays over at the warehouse and does classwork after work. Pretty impressive. I'm in that warehouse. Like, I eat, sleep, no. Yeah, all day. I'm in here 30 minutes. Yeah. That's it. Nice. 25. Kevin, you're next. I pretty much have everything I need in here, but I want to slide out here. Yeah, slide down. Is that gonna into a so pool? Like a zip line to the warehouse door. That's not a bad Wake idea. Wake up in the morning, zip line to work. So, pretty much your one stop shop here. You know, the other guys gotta walk real far to get everywhere, but I got it all. Right? I got it all right here. Looks like you got room for another friend in here. Yeah, some dude named Jeremy comes and stays in that bottom one sometimes. I don't know who he is. I stay on this top one, I don't really need a mattress. So that's kind of the end of the tour. Oh, uh, <laughs> so we're not done. We're not done. <laughs> Bring you on in here to the kitchen. Don't get lost. So, got my mini fridge. It's like Mary Poppins purse, you know. It doesn't look big. She can fit all kinds of stuff in there. And then here, behind the pocket door, you got your old, your old dumper and whizzer. And then you got the shower, which I guess could be the wizard too. I guess it could be the dunker if you're brave enough. <laughs> <laughs> you just, you you're running late, you know, you gotta waffle stomp them nuggies down the drain. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> this dude's pooping in your shower, man. I don't think I'm gonna get fired anymore. <laughs> I'm not getting fired anymore. <laughs> There's someone worse than me. Kevin, have you pooped in the shower? No, I don't pee in it either. I'm not an animal. <laughs> I pee in my shower. You said all that stuff really quick, like, like you were walking through your routine for us. I don't believe that you have. Have you ever pooped in the shower? No. I bet you have. Dude, that's no. You way. are a disgusting Tennessee, just like Wes. Just like Wes. Was he Some about pooping? next intern will probably not come from Tennessee. I'm tired of them pooping in the showers. But in here, we got Rice Krispies. Oh, mega pack, family size. So you're sharing? You got bread and Rice Krispies and Powerade in here. Don't get the Dr. Pepper. The DP's in the water. You really are 22, aren't you? Yes, sir. <laughs> All right, next I'm gonna take you guys, I'm gonna show you the bunkhouse, which is where typically everybody stays first. Um, Make sure you're not a weirdo. Yeah. And then I'm going to take you to the flea market, which is a new house that we might put potential interns in. This is the bunkhouse. This is where usually people will come and stay for their, their first couple of days or weeks, where we kind of make sure that they're not like weirdos, or at least if they're weirdos, they're like harmless weirdos. So this is the OG bunkhouse right here on Radiator Ranch. This is the one, this is the bunkhouse. Um, Old TV doesn't work, bunk beds, love seat. This chair is one of the most comfortable chairs you'll ever sit in. Uh, bathroom, nice, big bathroom. I'm guessing this sucker's probably, I don't know, 500 square feet, something like that. That's the kitchen. And uh, I mean kitchen, yeah. We like to put, we'll hang this up, just it helps the AC not have to work so hard at night. Um, and then the bathroom is uh so so we don't have to go in there stand up shower it's pretty it's a nice bathroom just take my word for it water heater and uh this is where our next intern will stay so we're in the process of looking looking through some some videos if you're interested in becoming an intern just real quick text the word intern to 940-353-0890 
And um, when we need another one, I'm going to send out instructions on how to become an intern. So right now I'm going to take you guys to the, uh, the next house that we might use to house interns. It's right here in Winnebago. So um, yeah, this is the bunkhouse. This is where the next one's going to stay. And then now we're going to uh, the Broadway house. Welcome to the, uh, the newest bunkhouse. We don't know what we're going to call it yet, but uh, right here in sunny Winnebago, close to Radiator Ranch. This is the living room. We're doing a few light renovations. Uh, Ooh, a new floor. New flooring in. Got a, uh, yeah, we're going to have to stock this thing. So y'all doing a great job. We're just uh, replacing the floor joints, valves, and some it's contractor talk. Don't worry about it. Yeah, they know what I'm talking about. Yo, yep. three bedroom. Yeah, original hardwood. Mmm, fancy. Redoing the bathroom. Don't film in there. Yeah, this is where the uh, the newest newest interns will stay. After these will be this will be another month or so because we still gotta go get furniture for it and everything. Do you? Uh... Did you pick this place for the newest newest so that I have to watch over them? Yeah, it's across the street from Leroy, so you're welcome. So if you're a weirdo, don't come to my house. I guess this is it. Well, we could go look at the Airbnb. Yeah. Let's go check out the Airbnb. Welcome to Dale b, &B. That's right, this is an Airbnb located right outside of the Dale Warehouse um, in sunny Newcastle, Texas. That's where the Dale Warehouse is. Different address, different town than Radiator Ranch. But the, uh, the Dale b, b right here, super cozy little spot, sleeps a lot of people. We, I think it's five. Sleeps five pretty comfortably. Got the couch, we've got a, um, is that a futon? That might be a futon. Anyway, it's a, it's a double bed, a bunk bed. That's a queen, another futon. Little bar area, granite countertops. Don't let these raggedy clothes fool you, old son. Got your little dining room table right underneath. Netflix, where we usually like to play um, How to Be a Cowboy for when our guests show up. You got Dale Brisby in the warehouse where you can meet him or you can watch him on the screen. Check out my favorite part of the whole building. The laundry room. No. Oh. Not the laundry room. The shower. Dude, this is not going to shower my house. And I know you've heard me say that before. You've also heard Willie say it, unbeknownst to me. Those are actually the clips that made me think that he might be my long lost son. Check out the pooper. Come on. Granite countertops in there, too. Just got Granite the. Granite countertops uh, on the pooper? Got a very, you know, industrial type. Just down home cotton gin vibe. Brick. I think that's what this used to be is cotton gin. Washer, dryer. Well, we had some hunters stay for a dove opening se a weekend of dove season. They came in. And so, anyway, 72 degrees right now. That's what we got it set on. So, like 108 outside. But your boy got it nice and cool in here. Dale BB. Those are all the uh, rodeo time properties that we got going on. So, you've seen. Five intern dwellings and the Dale B&B. So, good for you, man. If you really want to be an intern, that would be one way: is to book the Dale B&B and come meet the crew. But you just gotta watch out for our schedule. Sometimes we're out of town. That would suck. <laughs> they book it and we're gone. I thought but you were. You can message us on the Dale B&B app, and we'll tell you whether we're here or not. On the Airbnb. There's been some developments in the housing situation for the Daleware interns, Radiator Ranch interns here in Winnebago, uh, the flea market has been finished and we've put someone in it. So we're gonna show you kind of the new setup because <clears throat> it's uh, it's fun. I've not been in there in a few days. A lot of it is some furniture and decorations that I gave the young men. <sighs> we'll see how they dressed it up we're coming in unannounced well we just announced it but they don't have time to clean it we're trying to catch them doing something
going out wide, son. Willie, coming in there steep. Son, I forgot about that. Good yeah, luck. I've been, I've been cleaning up the place. Yeah, we got the garage cleaned up. We just moved all the trash from in here to out there. It's our pile of stuff. Throw that up later. I think I Woo! Smells good. Yeah, we didn't pay the electric bill. Power's off. <laughs> <laughs> nice. This is one of my paintings. I like it because it's like, you can't tell if the Indians were crossing that body of water or if they're coming up out of it. Trippy. And then this is probably my favorite painting. Obviously, roping a grizzly. It's gonna be a bear, be a grizzly. Or rope one. Wow, this is where Donnie normally sits and plays 2048. What did this table cost you? 150 bucks. Jordan Not found it and then Donnie bad. and I went and picked it up. Not bad. That is a solid purchase. Donnie beat me five games in a row and I haven't played since. Six, seven, actually. Seven games in a row, <laughs> haven't played six. Dude, you better get back to get to practicing. I know. It needs to be leveled. Yeah. Donnie, was, were you using it to your advantage? No. It was really frustrating me. It's probably helping me out more than anyone. That's our future podcast room. What are you going to call that podcast, by the way? I don't know. I still have to think about it. I was trying to think of something clever. I was hoping Donnie's creativity could help out. I think that's a cool background. <clears throat> I was going to make a little sound on the desk right here. Ciao. Ah! Uh, the bathroom was like the worst part of the whole house. It was like there was a huge hole in the floor. The tub was caving in. Like, I mean, it wasn't like caving in, but... And it was a medium sized hole, but yeah, but it's brand new now. Holes in the floor? Nope, no good. Nope, no good. It's a nice bathroom. And Kevin, you got, number one, you got a big TV. Number two, this is way cleaner than you kept the container. I have places to put things, like my rack. To be honest, this is probably about the same square footage. Yeah, but his kitchen's not in there. Yeah, yeah, and the, yeah, and the bathroom. That's true. Yeah. That's Rocky. Big Don hit the chuckle. Big Don's looks America. Like Dude, he's even got his own bathroom. I thought it was a closet the first time I seen it. It is a it's closet. Both. It's a closet. It's a it's a bathroom closet. A blazet is what we call it. But um, Donnie, do you feel like I'm? These new interns are getting. Special treatment? No, times are just different than when I got here, you know. We yeah. just didn't have the resources at the time. That's true. Thank you for joining us on this uh, tour of all the intern. We didn't go look at your house. Mm -mm. You don't want us to? We can. What's up? Do y'all want to go see it? Yeah. Sure. Can't yeah. Hear it now. <laughs> Let's go see it. Do y'all want to go see it? Yeah, I've never been over there before. Let's go see Donnie and uh, Jordan's house. And here we are, right in the Jordan and Donnie homestead. Dude, it smells good in here. It smells better in here than it does in uh, um, Willie's house. Yeah, we're not animals. Yeah, but I just wouldn't expect that out of you. No offense. Yeah. Sure, our house smell good too. We gotta go. Y'all got spice racks. Dude, that's Joe. That's got Joe's name written all over it. Hey man, it's hard life, but someone's gotta live it. Is she gonna care if we go in her room? Probably not. Star, do you care? Nah, she's keeping it clean. Yeah, she's not dirty. I don't, wait, this door wasn't here, right? No. Yeah, we added that. Yeah. That's right. What was there before? Just a room. Just a, just a, uh, just a walk Which through. is weird, because there's a bathroom back there. Like, why wouldn't you make it into a bedroom? Right. Let's check out Donnie's room. <laughs> yeah, I've been, a, been a, on the road some lately, so it's... Yeah. It's not as clean. It's been blowing me going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Rango's in there. I better let him out. Rango! 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 Rango
Thank you for joining us here at uh, the uh, Jordan Donnie Homestead, where we. What's what do y'all call this place? The house. The house. Yeah. All right. We're at the house. We just left the flea market, and we're going back to the Dale Warehouse now, um, right here in Winnebago, Texas. So that's been a quick tour of all the intern living situations. So um, hopefully you can one day be living in one of these spots. So. Text because we've obviously got since now that Mutt and Jeff are living in the flea market, the 40 foot and the 20 foot are open. We got a spot for one of the two. Um, Todd is an intern. He's coming. He's going to be here soon. And then we got one more spot open, and we got the bunkhouse. So um, if you are interested in being an intern, text the word intern to 940-353-0890. And whenever we need one, I'm going to send out a YouTube video telling you how to apply. It's pretty simple. So text intern to 940-353-0890. And I'm on to the next one, old son. I know you're wondering about the cap. Where to get it? Shirt, dalebrisby.com. Quick plug. Thanks for watching.